Hi guys, welcome back to uh, Extreme Overclocking Yobbo. Put my 270 back together, Apex 270, with my 7700K mint one chip. So I've got the 4133 AOPCB Trident G Skill B die in there, 191919 kit. So I thought I'd uh, have a bit of a play. Went back to an old uh, uh, profile that was saved in there from a while ago and had a play with it. And I'm just quite surprised at what voltage it took to get up to the frequency I got to. Uh, XMP volts 1.35, um, push it upwards of you know 4300 megahertz. So uh, it's all in the vid, you'll see. I won't repeat myself twice. Enjoy. Dink. One second. First, a word from our sponsor. Durex condoms. Without them, what are kids? So these are the timings. Uh, it seems the memory posts I'm putting up have been a bit, a bit popular. So uh, this is a kit of 4133 G Skill B die uh, C19. It's nine, the 191919 19. timing, not the 1921. Uh, AO non RGB PCB that I've used for some good super pie. This is the settings. I mean, I've mucked around with this a lot, but this is just sort of is a, is a little bit cool. I mean, 1.35 volts, which is XMP volts. Uh, so far, it's sitting at uh, uh, 4360. I'll loosen the timings right off, but still impresses me a little bit. I mean, tell me if tell me if it doesn't impress. Uh, it actually surprised me, and so I pointed out. So that's at 105.5 BCLK. This is a profile I had set in BIOS from a while ago, and I left a lot of it on where I don't, I normally set a lot of this. Uh, I haven't, so I'm gonna just play with it and, and take note. Now the timings for it, very loose, 19, my God. I thought I had 1926, 26, 63 in here. The pro XMP, 1999 and 39. So it's got the one on 1.35 volts. On XMP profile, it's gotten to. What am I doing here? It's gotten to four three six zero megahertz. So the rest of it is. Um, I'll show you the complete bio settings just at this point. All auto auto auto. Uh, I have put the IO and SAs up. One point three one point three. Um, and don't believe, let me just see, uh, MRC, MCH haven't been touched, so if you're on Apex you'll know. So I might just go into BIOS on software now and see what that'll clock to from there using um, uh, VCore VCor tuner. I'll be back. It's about 44.40 where it's stuck. After that, it froze and I put it up 0.5 BCLK. So uh, there you go, interesting. 1.35 volts, XMP, I think it's a good frequency. That's with two dims too, not a single dim. I've been doing some frequency with single dim. This is this is with the two. Um, there's some voltages set very auto by BIOS, but uh, standby voltage is still at uh, one, one volt. Um, PLL still at one. Anyway, just thought the memory guys out there and people overclocking DDR4 might find it interesting. <laughs> Whether you do or not, that's the machine I'm running it in. Uh, Z7, I should tell you, Z270 Apex 7700K. Uh, and I've told you about the RAM. This is maybe a Christmas tree for, for this period of period of the year. Just reassembled this in my main rig and 480 by 60 rad up there. And it's good up and needs tidying up. If I decide I'm going to keep it as a main rig, then I'll do some better management of this cable and shit down here. Anyway, thanks for uh, watching. Uh, please sub, like, all that. I'm a small guy. Any little bits of help I could get to sort of uh, do a bit of promotion would be great. I'm not much at self promoting because I've got many. I'm 48 and I'm in an era where you don't go out and social media and self promote. But, um, Need others to do it for me, really. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Yobbo out. Think.